Welcome back, this is Yama Jack, and today we got Airship Suicidal Gunslinger. Let's go! Alright, alright. I haven't done Airship in a while. I like Airship. It's like the, uh, the logical... You know, next step of, uh... I've wanted to make a game recently. Every now and then I have, uh, an urge to make, uh... Make a game of some sort. I never actually like make a proper game, but I uh, I end up making I, I get the hard stuff done, right? I get the uh, well the the hard stuff to other people, but not the hard stuff to me. Um, I get the uh, the fun stuff done, I guess we'll we'll call it. Where I get the the the, the game working, and uh, then I just I don't end up actually making a storyline or quests or NPCs or anything that's uh, I just end up making like a game engine right and I do it all the time because I just I just have to I just have fun with it but I'm having a craving to make um, an idle game recently actually which I don't know maybe I could make something out of that could be fun I play a lot of idle games they're just it's, it's dopamine right it's dopamine you, you, you leave it and you come back and you got 3E2, you know, and you're like, wow, 3E2, I only had a smaller 3E2 earlier, and now I have a whole bigger 3E2, and it just feels good. You get to, you get the prestige, and you get all those, uh, those extra fancy bits, I don't know, it's just, uh, it doesn't take time either, it's not a, it's not a big commitment, so... To me, it's just fun. I've wanted to make an idle game recently. I'm not sure what I'd make it, though. I've, I've been thinking making, like, a rain meter idle game, because, like, an, a, a clicker game kind of thing in rain meter, because that'd be fun, right? I know that somebody has done it before, but they didn't do a good job of it. They made it as a meme, right? They didn't make it in, in, in earnest. So, I feel like uh, if I were to do something and I were to do it in earnest, it would, it would be better, because... It was done in earnest. I feel like if they did it in earnest, it would have been better than, than what they made. But they just made it a meme for the sake of making a meme. And I want to make an actual game that people actually want to download and play. At least if they're interested in clicker games. Yeah, I want I, my, my goal with it, which will definitely never happen, is uh, for people on like the idle clickers subreddit... To be like, yeah, yeah, no, you should play this game. You have to download the rain meter uh, thing for it, and then it's like a skin that you have to install. It's like kind of weird, but like super fun, you know. Yeah, that's my goal. That's my end goal. I'm not even sure if I'll make the game at all, let alone if it'll get to the point where people are telling other people to download rain meter to play it. But cloaker, where you got a cloaker? I see you. I see you. I can't. So it could be fun. Cause Rain, like, yeah, I've made uh, game engines in Rain Meter before. And uh, for y'all who don't know Rain Meter, that's like mad impressive. Um, but never, uh, never a clicker kind of engine, you know? Maybe, maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe instead of making, uh, maybe instead of making, no, I think I can survive this, and I can. Maybe instead of making an idle clicker, I'll make an idle clicker, like, maker. So you put in, like, the, the, the animations and all that stuff, and then it just kind of handles all of that for you. Come on, can we make this shot? Nope, because he kind of moved. He moved and made me uh, look bad. Can I, were none of those headshots? I swear, at least one of those was a headshot. Both of those were not headshots. Oh, you know what? It must have bounced off his stupid... Yeah, that. That's what must have happened. Hate that stupid thing. Alright, let's kick let's let's get these guys doing. I think there's two more. Yeah, right. Oh my. More than more than just two more. We got like a billion more. You can't hit me here. Apparently he could. Apparently he could. 
So maybe I'll just make like a clicker maker thing. And give it your animations and handles all the, the hard stuff. Cause that'd, that'd, that'd be more up my alley. Sounds more like something I would do. I'm not even sure if I'll do it. I haven't been too into developing right uh, recently. Like I want to go and do something, but I'm not welding anything. I'm not welding anything. This is such a bad map for objectives. Like they made actual objectives, but then they also kind of didn't. It's just copy and paste, but even worse. Isn't there an act? I picked it up. Okay. Okay. I forgive you. I forgive you. I thought there was an ammo crate there, but um, I guess I already, I already picked it up. Yeah. I practice. Uh, I was talking in a recent episode about the Nahuat, and I, I practice that like sound a lot. It's uh, it's good fun. It's a fun sound. It's like um, if I were going to try and, and describe how I internalize the sound, you're basically you're just saying like a normal t, like a normal t, but you have to kind of like put your tongue in a way that it's also an L, but you don't want to say L. You just you just want to say t, but have your tongue as if you were saying L. So it kind of ends up being like, t, like, t, with with like a little bit of a hint of a of a, of an L whisper, you know. But you don't want to have that like L sound. It's kind of how I internalize it. But I I, uh, I practice it a lot because it's uh, it's a really fun sound for one. And then uh, one of the players in uh, in D and D. He, uh, he named his character a name that has these sounds. And uh, I'm like, well, they'll probably end up in court someday, so I have to <laughs> I have to know how to pronounce it, right? So the judge isn't going to be like, uh, it's Ishqua Piltikli as to Piltik Michelin. And he's not going to be like that. He's, he's going to know how to pronounce it properly because uh, I decided so. And. I want the judge to seem like he knows what he's doing, and I want to show off. That's really it. So, but uh, I have to I have to practice it quite a lot. So I end up like whenever I'm bored or something, and I don't have anything to do, uh, I'm just sitting there like t, 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 t. You know, just like endlessly. Like people, anybody who can hear me right now probably sounds like I probably sound like just a complete idiot, but I just sit there like trying to, to pronounce it. So the way that the way that I've got it up to Ishqua Piltek Tliesta Piltek Misatan, but that that sound is really really hard to do because it's not a sound that you have in the English language. It's uh, it's called a, a voiceless Afri voiceless Africat. I believe is what it's called. So it's, it's a fancy little sound, and it's uh, I don't know why I'm trying to even go there because I'm definitely not doing it. Because this is a horrible, horrible death trap. Yeah, no, I'm I'm not no, I'm not I'm not standing there. I'll wait until you tell me to pull the lever lever again, and I'll run back through. If he even tells me to pull the lever lever again. And it's just one of the many things I learned talking to this uh, this fella into linguistics. I could probably, like, honestly, I could go on for, like, an entire week talking about all the things that I've learned about uh, language and, and history and all of that. But I feel like it would probably bore people because, A, I feel like it's just kind of a boring subject that most people don't really care about. Like, I mean, how many people really care about, you know, some, some language that uh, is barely even spoken anymore by by anybody of, uh, 
I mean, obviously there are important people who speak it, but it's not a language that is spoken by, like, somebody who you have to actually pay attention to to be able to, like, survive in this world and, and thrive. Like, the presidents and leaders of, of, uh, of, of whatever, they're not speaking this language. It doesn't really benefit you to, to know about it. Outside of if you care about it. Which, I don't know. Maybe you do, but I'm not saying that important people don't speak it, but if, if important things are being said, it's probably not being said in that language because it's not really well known. But I know other things about, uh, about linguistics now. Yeah, I wanted that ride. Um, I don't know, I could talk, I could talk for, talk endlessly about it, but I'm not going to because it would bore you. And I'm not trying to be a boring person. I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe somebody would find it interesting, but... It's hard to find topics that you want to talk about that would actually be, like, interesting to people. Because a lot of the stuff that I, I do is niche stuff. Right? There are some people who will be super into it, but the vast majority of people are just not really going to care. And, uh... Yeah, like, I, uh... I can talk about, um, and I kind of do, but when it's something that I do personally, um, I guess I'm, I'm more inclined to talk about it even though I can recognize it as being something that's boring. Like, talking about how my script isn't picking up Berserker or whatever. Like, that's probably something that most people don't really... Hello, you are right beside me? Or are you on the other side? Other side. Um, like talking about my my OCR and and whatnot is probably something that most people aren't going to find interesting because it's kind of a niche topic that most people aren't even going to know exists and understand well enough to, to understand what I'm saying. You know what I mean? And uh, when it's when it's something that that isn't something that I specifically have done. Like I, I've been talking to somebody who was doing something that kind of fits into that category of, of things that are, are relatively niche, you know, then uh, I guess it's just harder for me to, to motivate myself to, to talk about it because I can't explain it in a well that I can't, I can't explain it well enough to make it interesting, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, the moral of the story is I practice that t sound a lot and uh, I, think I think I'm getting better at it now, but it's a hard sound to do, and uh, y'all should y'all should also practice it because it's kind of fun. It's a, it's a fun sound to to, to say. And that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, like and subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.